I'm just going to film myself in here for now uh, since I'm going to give a room tour and say a few words ahead of time. I'm at the Beach Club Villas, room 471, fourth floor, and it has an Epcot view. I did get an upgrade today. It's 9.55 a.m. My room was assigned around 9 a.m. I think I was at Mass this morning over at uh, Corpus Christi in celebration. And they said that I should go to the front desk for my room assignment. But I did notice that there was a room number in my app. So I may have had something to do with the magic band. It may have had something to do with an upgrade. I'm not sure. But anyway, room 471. And this is the entryway. I'm super stoked that I have an upgrade. I'm more stoked that the room was ready for a silly reason. I, I like cream in my coffee, real cream. And I've been here for a few days and I buy it. Um, and I just hate for it to sit in my car uh, all day. And sometimes I just don't want to wait for, let's say, um, bell services to retrieve my baggage just so I can get my cream. <laughs> So I'm so glad it's ready. I could put it right in the fridge. And look at this. There's a view of Epcot. Looks like Living with the Land. I'm behind Living with the Land and uh, Spaceship Earth. Let's take a look out here. Where's my sliding door on this side? So bear with me with the camera as I figure this out. Oh, it's a super spacious balcony, too. So if I back up at the end, you can see that there are two sliding glass doors. One is off of the living room and one is off of the bedroom area. This is just a beautiful view. I've never seen this view. I, I think that in the past it was probably blocked by trees, um, but they really cleared this out. I, I'm not sure what I like better, having this cleared out or having it more secluded. But a great view. A lot of sunshine, quite beautiful. So let's go back in so you can see what a um, one bedroom looks like. Here's the living area, the lamp, a phone, an end table, a pull-out sofa, a coffee table that I'm sure opens up if you need additional storage space. Let's see. Oh, it doesn't open up. Okay, looks very much like the one at the Polynesian that opens. Um, maybe they have drawers here. Yeah, drawers. So if you have people staying on the sofa bed, they have some storage space as well. Little dresser space. And then there's the TV. Monday, April 26th, 9.57 a.m. I'll call this my happy birthday upgrade since my birthday is coming up soon. And then there are some shelves in the credenza and drawer space. A couple of counter height stools in the kitchen area at the kitchen bar. There's just two of them. And there's a little, maybe you call this a banquette, uh, with some Mickey shaped plates and the in-room dining menu. And I may have to actually take advantage of that just to enjoy the room because I'm only here for one night. Here's the kitchen area. Coffee maker is always a thing. I usually end up bringing like Keurig pods, K-cups, and uh, I never know what kind of uh, coffee maker I'm going to get. So, so far in all the villas, it's been the full service coffee maker, and they do give you some coffee. And wow, we have real plates. I haven't seen real plates in a while, real dishes. I've been seeing a lot of paper plates. I just stayed at the Polynesian and Old Key West and everything was paper and plastic. Oh, real coffee cups, real wine glasses. I know I'm making a big deal about it, but it's kind of a big deal. I don't like drinking out of paper and plastic or eating. And then some glasses, rocks glasses, water glasses, juice glasses, a toaster. A couple of pot holders. I don't want to overlook the ice bucket, paper towels, a drawer full of utensils, a can opener, knife, a whisk. It's like a pasta, whatever you call that thing, a um, spatula, slotted spoon, whole spoon, regular flatware. 
nothing in these cabinets down here. We have a dishwasher and they give you uh, soap, recycle can, garbage can, dish soap, dishwasher soap, sponges. And in this cabinet we have a rack for the oven, a cutting board, and it looks like a cookie sheet or a jelly roll pan. Nothing in there. We have a pot. Microwave. And the stove. The oven. There's more pots in the storage at the bottom. I know sometimes with ovens the bottom is a broiler. This is going to get a little stuck here. Move this around. Okay. And then above the refrigerator, there's a tea kettle. And that's it. And a decent sized freezer refrigerator. The other thing that I'm super stoked about is washer and dryer, because you know I'm going to wash my clothes before I head home tomorrow. So glad there's some soap here. I hope there's some laundry detergent. If not, I do have a packet of laundry detergent with me. Here's the bathroom, one of the bathrooms. This is the shower. No. I see a lotion, a bar of soap, um, then there are the smaller sized amenities in the shower. There's a soap, a shower gel, conditioner, and shampoo. And the commode room. And then the bedroom. So uh, let's see, let's do the bedroom. King size bed, looks very comfortable. A desk, a lamp, some plugs on the desk, a phone. There are some plugs on the nightstand as well. They have some USB plugs and regular outlets. And then of course there is the balcony, the other end of it. There's a chair, a table lamp, television, a dresser, and is this really a chest here? Oh, they do have a drawer. So if you need additional drawer space, that might be good for a piece of luggage to fit in. And a mirror, almost full size, almost like a three-quarter sized mirror. And then the master bath has this super cool bathtub. I love these bathtubs. When I bought it at Grand Floridian years ago, they came with the, uh, the villas there. Here is some more soap and shower gel and a wastebasket. Soap and lotion. I'm glad to see lotion because it seems to be a premium these days. A makeup mirror. That's always nice to have. A laundry basket, luggage rack, some hangers in the closet, extra pillows and blanket, an iron, a vacuum, in case you make a mess, an ironing board, and a safe. Always good to have a safe. And then this takes us into the other bathrooms. There's only one commode in here. If you needed more than one, um, that's something to be concerned with, but one of course is enough for just me. Or if there were two of us, that's fine. And that's it. Room 471 Beach Club Villas. I think I'll end it in the mirror with me over here. Hello again. Heading to Epcot today for my last day in April of 2021.
Jump into the 